Welcome to Exchange Survival. Today we're going to unbox the X Dragon 70 watt solar panel. Alright, so it's a solar charger and it's it's a website. It's sent from China, Guangzhou. Alright, so let's open it up. I'm gonna remove all the packaging first and then lay out all the equipment that's inside the box. Okay, here is our solar panel, instructional manual, and the cables. Okay, not much packaging to protect the solar panel. Alright, so let's lay out the wires. And this is what we have. Alright, so the solar X Dragon. 70 watt solar panel is about, let's measure it, 33 centimeters long and 17.5 centimeters. About 7 centimeters. If you look over here, it's about 5 centimeters. Overall, it looks really sturdy, very nice texture. Even have a loop here, but it's pretty thick. Alright, in terms of size comparison, we have a Surface 7 Pro over here. You can put it side by side, you can see how thick this solar panel is. And how long it is. Okay, so if you're gonna charge laptops with this solar panel, you might consider how you're going to pack all this into your bag. Here's another size comparison in terms of a very big laptop. Okay. You can see that the length is about the same as the laptop. In terms of height or width, the laptop is bigger. So it's very important to consider if you want to use this portable solar panel, how you're going to pack it in your bag. So this is an instruction manual. So here are the specifications for the solar panel. So this is your DC cable to connect to your solar generator or your laptop. It has a USB, micro USB cable we have four carabiners or hooks we also have alligator clips or crocodile clips to charge your battery directly from the X dragon okay this will be the port to go into the solar panel itself and I believe this may be a, a fuse. This is to control the power that's coming from the solar panel to your load, just to protect both devices. That's a fuse. These are the five adapters. You can connect them to the laptop or other loads or a solar generator. If you were to connect them, you just put them in together. So this is the layout of the X Dragon solar panel. Let's have a look inside. So from the outside is a Velcro opening. It has a pouch here to store your wires and cables or even put your power bank inside. Quite a lot of space. Even put your phone inside. Okay. And your solar charger or solar controller has three output ports, two USB C, a uh, USB C covered with a rubber silicon over here. Five volts and 2.4 amperes each. And this is the solar panel. 18 
watt discharge or output and over here there's a light indicator that turns on when the solar panel is being charged and this is what makes the X Dragon so special is that it has a parallel connection so you can add another solar panel connect this together and you can have higher voltage and collect more energy so this is pretty neat and Here it is. Let's put it on the ground and unfold the solar panel. So it has nine solar panels, small ones, and it is nine centimeters long. This be one point five centimeters wide. If you were to include this part. It'll be about 71 centimeters. It has a few loops so you can hang it on a tree or by a string. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, nine loops. So we have four carabiners so we can hang it at the corners. It's quite big so it'll be quite difficult to hang it at your back to get any sun when you're moving. So this type of solar panel is best to be put in an RV or car so you can do your adventures. The problem with this is that the loops sometimes get caught here so it may be harder to close and then if you push too hard you may damage the wiring inside. But this is quite a solid piece of a solar panel. You can see the solar charger is here. You can see a bump. For the solar charge controller over here so you may want to put some wires here to flatten this out so this is so this is the x dragon solar charger 70 watts foldable solar panel